Bishop's Opening, Berlin, Vienna Hybrid, Hermadka Variation. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed Black in that one. White took advantage of the opportunities they saw in the opening. White was a cut above Black in the middle game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. A typical answer is e5, which builds a position in the middle, controls d4, and frees up the queen and bishop on the dark square. White has the choice of playing f4 or advancing the queen on the next move after the bishop's opening bc4 attack on the f7 square and control of d5. Nf6 develops the knight and attacks the undefended e4 pawn. It is best. d3 helps the dark squared bishop to grow while protecting the e4 pawn and the c4 bishop. It is ideal. Nc6 develops the knight toward the center, protects the e5 pawn and controls the d4 square. It is good. Nc3 develops the knight toward the center, controls the d5 square and supports the e4 pawn. It is good. BB4 develops the bishop and pins the knight. It is good. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is quite good. This threatens to win a bishop. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Backs off. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is the last book move. This misses a chance to strengthen a knight's defense by adding a defender. It is incorrect. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. As a result, the opponent's pawn structure is weakened because they are forced to double their pawns. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. That's good. Backs off. This poses a threat to an open file and a rook. It is ideal. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This stops the opponent from being able to take an open file with a rook. It is best. By doing this, a queen moves off of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is incorrect. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This prevents the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is best. This avoids the bishop's check. It is ideal. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. This is the only good move. This threatens to fork pieces. It is a great move. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is a mistake. This overlooks an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is a miss. This threatens to win a knight. There was only one good move in that position. It is a miss. This gains time by putting a queen in danger and getting it to flee. It is ideal. This ignores a safer approach to moving a queen. It is incorrect. The rook is now on an open file, which helps control squares across the board. It is quite good. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. By posing a threat to a bishop and compelling it to flee, this gains a tempo. It is ideal. The bishop is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. Although white had had the upper hand, the game is now almost even. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to center a knight so that it can dominate more squares. It is incorrect. This might indicate that a bishop was attacked. It is ideal. This makes it impossible for the adversary to disclose an attack on a bishop. It is ideal. 
This wins time by threatening a bishop and forcing it to retreat away. It is ideal. The bishop is now in a secure position. It is ideal. The knight becomes more active as a result, gaining control over more of the board. It is ideal. Black's situation was worse, but now they are losing. It is incorrect. This is how you take the pawn. That's good. This is a missed chance to kick a knight. It is incorrect. This poses a fork piece threat. It is incorrect. This gives the adversary the chance to win a tempo by posing a rook threat. It is incorrect. There was just one smart move to be made. This misses a chance to suggest winning a rook. It falls flat. This ignores a more effective approach to link rooks. It is incorrect. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. This attacks a bishop, winning a tempo when it moves away. This is the only good move. It is a great move. The bishop is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. This comes in several sections. It is ideal. This moves away from the knight in shining armor. It is ideal. This is winning stuff. It is ideal. Thus, a forced checkmate is possible. It is incorrect. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This keeps on until checkmate is reached. It is ideal. Backs off. It is quite good. This continues the checkmate threat. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. White took advantage of the opportunities they saw in the opening. White was a cut above black in the middle game.